Hi there, welcome to Platform Tutorials. Today I'm going to show you how you can customize WooCommerce product page using UX Builder. Customizing product page is an awesome feature of UX Builder. Before heading to the product page customization, let's select a product layout page that we will customize in this tutorial. For demonstration purpose, we can select left column product page layout from the Flatsum official demo. In the product customizer, we have termed this layout full height left sidebar. If you want to customize this product page without manually building page elements in UX Builder, you have to head to the Flatsum official documentation page and search for the short course for the Flatsum custom product page layout. In this page, we have added short course for all available product page layouts so that you can select your desired page short course and start customizing in the UX Builder. As we are going to customize full height left sidebar layout, I will copy the short course for the layout and create a new block with my given title. You have to paste the short code inside the block editor and publish the block. Now we are one step away to customize our product page layout. So let's navigate to product page theme option and select custom layout icon. After that, you have to select your newly created block from custom product layout dropdown. In my turn, it's full height left sidebar layout. When your block selection is completed, simply save the settings. To start customizing product page layout, first we have to get inside any of a product page. In the product page, you can notice an option called UX Builder. Select Edit UX Builder button and wait till the UX Builder is completely loaded. This is the basically the block we created adding layout shortcuts from the documentation. Now you can rearrange elements from the left toolbar or drag and drop elements to your desired location based on your requirement. It's not end here. You can reorder the product page element from the builder preview and change its setting from the element option. Even you can add new elements from the builder in this product page. Example, I have added a custom banner next to the add to cart button. But you can add any number of builder elements in your selected layout positions. When your product page customization is completed, select the update button to save the changes for the product page block. Now start browsing your product pages and enjoy the customization without touching the theme code base. So that's all for today. See you in the next video.